Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer software testing interview question 178. That is, what is the duration of sprint? Let me answer. First of all, we need to understand what is sprint. What is sprint? In agile scrum methodology following projects, sprint is nothing but an iteration, okay? The work will happen in the form of iterations in the agile scrum methodology following projects. That is, work will happen in the iterations that is some set of work will be assigned to the first iteration after that set of work is completed the next iteration will start where other set of work will be assigned like this the project will be completed in the form of iterations in agile scrum methodology following projects iterations will continue here each and every iteration is known as sprint guys okay here each and every iteration i am talking about is known as sprint it has a time bound okay they are time bound this iterations that is sprints okay this each and every sprint or iteration are time bound. What is a time bound means? There is some specific time allocated, okay, to complete this work. The work that is assigned to this particular iteration or sprint need to be completed by the end of the sprint. That is in which time, how much time? That is time bound, okay? That's what I am talking about. So what is the duration of this sprint then? The duration of the sprint can be, depending on project to project, the duration of sprint can be one to four weeks, okay? It can be one to four weeks, but most of the projects, but most of the projects ideally will follow two weeks guys okay for better results most of the following most of the projects uh, in the market follow ideally the sprint duration has two weeks even though one to four weeks is allowed most of the projects in the market ideally follow two weeks as their sprint duration two weeks means how many days two weeks is ideal okay ideally ideal case is two weeks two weeks sprint duration two weeks means how many days it is 10 working days okay 10 working days if you exclude that saturday and sunday every time right you will you will be left with uh, in two weeks you will be left with 10 working days in 10 working days the work that is assigned to this particular sprint or iteration need to be completed by the end of the sprint again next set of work will be assigned estimated uh, assigned to the next uh, sprint or iteration and that need to be completed again in 10 working days if the sprint duration for that particular project is set to two weeks in that case okay otherwise it can be one to four weeks depending on project to project so hope guys uh, you understood what is the duration of sprint in this session so that's all for this session in the next session i'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you till then see you bye bye